Hello guys, welcome to Angular 6 video tutorial by Tech Tech Tutes. And in this video tutorial, we are quickly going to learn how to do search engine optimization SEO of your Angular app or Angular websites. So there are two steps involved. Number one, we need to add meta tags in your inside your Angular 6 app, and in the second step, we need to render your application via server server rendering. So both steps are necessary to make your Angular 6 app or Angular 6 website SEO friendly. So let's get into it and do the first step, adding meta tags inside your Angular 6 app. So before I add these things, I must have to tell you that this tutorial is specifically for Angular 6 and upcoming versions of Angular. So this will not work for Angular 5. So if you are still using Angular 5, so I will recommend you to upgrade yourself to Angular 6 at least so that you can take advantage of this video tutorial. Otherwise, there is a longer way to create SEO for Angular 5 apps, which I may be published, may publish in a later time. So first I will go to src folder in the app folder then i will go into app component or ts so to add meta tags first of all i need to add a meta object so i need to import it from meta object from at the rate angular slash platform browser so this platform browser package contain a meta object which we will inject inside the constructor of your class so here we will do private meta and matter that's it oh, sorry i put it on the wrong place we need to put it in the brackets and after that we have some uh, features from this meta object and first feature is we can use meta dot add tag to add a single tag as an object suppose i add a tag name keyword so make sure that that name and contents are the keys for this add tag sorry i have put an e extra here as well so add tag comma then you do sorry content and then add your content like angular angular 6 angular seo so this meta tag will be added in your inside your angular app then meta add tag name and description content sorry uh, you shouldn't put brackets and the key a single course on the key so this is angular 6 seo tutorial so i have added both uh, meta tags here like this you can add as many meta tags as you like and after that i will um, open this application in the browser at the local host 4200 here this application is running so if i do page source view page source you will see i don't see this meta information here but if i do inspect element and go to the inspector here in the head section i can show you here you can see meta keywords content and meta name description and its content has been successfully embedded inside your angular app but we need to show these contents inside your view page source so that search engines can crawl your web application and it become seo friendly so for that there is only one step needed and after that you have done your task and in few next few seconds we will be installing angular 6 as a server side rendering app so i have opened a terminal inside atom which is a built-in atom terminal and here i am on the terminal so simply what i need to top type sorry ng add so as i said in my start that this tutorial is only for angular 6 and upcoming version because angular 5 does not have ng add feature which is a new feature introduced in angular 6 so add ng add at the rate ng2 kit slash universal that's it you just need to add this package inside your angular 6 app just wait for a few seconds or minutes and let it to be installed via npm tooling and it will automatically configure your ng toolkit universal inside your application no need to do any kind of configuration but in angular 5 you need to do all these steps one by one step by step create all files manually which are done by ng toolkit slash universal automatically now in angular 6 using ng add so just wait for a few seconds more and that's almost getting into it okay. 
so you see it did created some new files like local js server ts webpack server config source and inside source it create main server dot ts inside source ts config app browser so these all files you have to create manually if you are doing the same seo inside angular 5 and you need to copy these contents inside the, your angular 5 app if you want to use this in your angular 5 just do install a fresh copy of angular 6 and do this follow this tutorial after that you can copy those files and put them inside your angular 5 and they will work same like angular 6 so let it to be completed so it's done 305 packages have been installed so after that if you go to package.json file here you will see few new commands build server prod build browser prod build product or build and server right so now what i need to do is we don't need to use a uh, local uh, ng serve anymore here first we need to run npm run and this command we need to run build prod build prod and it will automatically build the production version uh, simply run it npm run prod and if you see any error we will rectify it right now so hopefully this there wouldn't be any error in it just we need to wait a few and yeah we got some errors so it's webpack cli problem so what we need to do so npm install webpack cli at the rate latest minus d so we need to install this package as a uh, development dependent uh, sorry dev dependency so just do npm install if you see this error you cannot read property properties of undefined module export so just do a webpack cli at the latest with minus capital d switch and it will add webpack cli inside your uh, angular app so let it to be finished again done webpack cli 3.1.2 is installed as a dev dependency here you can see in the package.json file so now that we can run this again again so npm run build prod and hopefully this time you won't see any error and your files will be compiled and another thing i want to mention here that after you build your product using ng uh, sorry uh, using ng toolkit uh, universal you have to use a live server which support node server configuration for the demo purpose you can upload this application on heroku because heroku can do uh, can run node.js applications so you see now it's working pretty fine and everything has been compiled and ignore these warnings they are just showing you some information that what is going to be deprecated in the future so for the time being just ignore it and now it's building the dist folder and here you will see a dist folder and this to this folder will have your angular app as an final version so it's compiling 90 percent 92 percent done and uglify js plugin is now optimizing your angular app so angular 6 have lots of new features which i haven't made a tutorial on it but if you need it do let me know and now it have two folders a server and a browser this server is needed to render these applications so now we need to run npm run server so it will automatically run this server.js from the dist folder and press the run press the enter button and now your application is available on localhost 8080 so go to your browser and now we need to type localhost 8080 so you see now your same application has been opened here and now if i go and view page source you will see your seo information here and the story i think it's going beyond the page just because it is minified but the thing is you can see here welcome to ng6 seo before you can't see it and as well as you see we can now see this meta information inside view page source now any search engine can easily crawl your web app or website you, which you have built using angular 6 and it can be seo friendly and can be indexed inside any search engine apart from i'm not only talking about here google so it can be uh, optimized for every search engine so 
friends you like this video tutorial don't forget to press the like like button and if you haven't subscribed to our channel do consider and subscribe to it we will bring more interesting videos like this not only on tutorials but tech videos and games videos as well so guys thank you very much and take care yourself bye